promises. We have a sure sign of spring yeah. for you. Our friends at Country Max have a new shipment of chicks. <laughs> I stopped by the Henrietta location this morning for a look at what's going on at Country Max stores as they gear up for something called Chick Days. Okay, cuteness overload. The chicks are here. Look at this, two day old chicks at the Country Max in Henrietta. I'm with Crystal Dizzle, the store manager. Crystal, oh my gosh. Okay, I'm just, my heart has been stolen. Um, but they're beyond adorable, yes, and that's what people must say when they first see mm -hmm. these baby chicks, right? Customers love them. Yeah. So they're available now, um, but that's uh, a couple things people need to know before they purchase one, right? Right. right. Yeah. Um, they do need to be purchased in six. Okay, so um, you can't just buy one chick, right? You no. got to buy six at you a gotta time. You got to buy a group of them. Okay. They are a flock animal, so um, they, they do a lot better when they're in a group. Yeah, so they're not isolated, right? They right. need to be together. Sad, yeah. yeah. Oh, look how adorable. These are two days old. Yep. So sweet. What kinds of um, varieties are these? So, like, there's different kinds of chickens, of course, right? So these are what What are these? Yep. So the yellow ones are Buff Orpingtons. Okay. The darker ones are Silver Laced uh, Wynadots. Okay. And then over here, we have um, the reddish ones mm -hmm. are Rhode Island Reds. Okay. And then the golden ones are Golden Comets. Oh, my goodness. And they're all layers. They're so adorable. Oh, I just, I can't, no, they flock together like that to stay warm. Mm -hmm. So this is the setup that you have right here. It's kind yes. of how you would care for them at home, right? Yep, You've got to. It, it doesn't necessarily have to be a bin like this. Okay. Um, but very similar. So you sell the supplies, yep. you sell the food. Mm -hmm. um, you also teach people how to care for them, yes. which I think is really yeah. neat, right? Yeah. So it's not just buy the chicken and take it home, right? right? Do you see that this is growing in popularity? Are people buying yes, more and more chickens? Yes, especially in Henrietta now that um, people can have them in their, in their yards. Yeah. And why do you think they're so popular with people um, just in general? They're easy to care for. Um, Free eggs. Yep, yep, <laughs> definitely. Are they easy to care for? Very easy, mm -hmm. yep. I see you've got the fresh water and the food. Now, by comparison, folks, what you're looking at here, these are two-week-old chickens. Yep, they grow very quickly. Oh my goodness, you can tell they're... they're yeah, um, their adult feathers are coming Is out. that why <laughs> they look like that? Yeah, yeah, they're in the... The awkward stage. <laughs> <laughs> Almost like the teenage years yep, of chickens. Yep. <laughs> um, I love this. So um, people can pre-register to purchase a chick mm -hmm. by this weekend, right? It's a deadline? Right. Uh, Sunday the 26th. Okay. And we have over 50 varieties to order. Okay. And then they'll arrive the last week of April. Okay. Yep. But these are available right now though, right? Yes. Okay. Yep. So these are, um, but if you want to have like a specific variety. Right you've got to pre-register for them. Yeah, yeah. Okay. This must be the most popular time of the year for your yes, business. Tell yeah, me why. It. What's it like when people come in here? Oh, they get so excited and <laughs> they bring their kids in and we just got these new bins this year so the kids can see through the window. Oh, I like That's that. Awesome. Are these available for purchase too, these bins here? Um, we have similar bins, yes. Okay, right. Yeah, not okay. with the windows, but very similar. Yeah. What's it take? Just plenty of food and fresh water yep. to care for a chicken? Food, water, not... you gotta have a heat source. Um, for how long would you need that, for like a heat lamp? Um, for the first few weeks. Okay. And then you can slowly start to introduce them to the outside. Yeah. It's important though, I mean, they're adorable, but they're living creatures and they need to be cared mm -hmm. for, right? Yep. Yeah, that's why you don't let people buy just one. Exactly. No, people might think, oh, it's a cute Easter basket right. thing, but, but no, these, you gotta care for them. Yep, exactly. Oh my goodness, the chicks are here. Make sure you come on out to the Country Max and Henrietta and take a good look. Again, pre-register for uh, the different varieties by this weekend. Uh, otherwise, they're available in April, right? Right. That's so wonderful. What's your favorite part of these little creatures? Uh, just watching them, playing with them, <laughs> watching them grow. Can I hold one? Yeah, Okay. Go for it. Okay, I'm going to try my hand at... Yeah. <laughs> okay, I did this as a little girl at my grandmother's house in Puerto Rico when I was a little girl. And I remember this, just grabbing a little chickadee. Hello, little chickadee. Hi, baby. So cute. I think he likes me, or she likes me. Yep, right? they're all females. They're all they're girls, all... that's important to point yep. out. <laughs> <laughs> Very Thank important. you so much, Crystal, I appreciate it. Yep. Come on down, get your chicks, they're right here. So cute, so adorable. <laughs> cheep, cheep, cheep. Ah. I'm so Whoa. in love. Oh, yeah. And we have some chicks on the set right Baby, now. No, no, we have the little so babies. Cute. By the way, if you can't get enough of these chicks, 
Uh, check out uh, Battle of the Chicks. May the cutest chick win. There's a contest Aww. we're running with Country Max on the 13 Wham and Country Max Facebook pages. Uh, it's called Battle of the Chicks. Each of the Country Max stores has elected a chick as their store mascot, and they need your vote. Everyone who votes is eligible for a chance to win a $50 gift card to Country Max. You can get all the details by visiting the contest page right now on 13wham.com. And we have some check chicks on the set. Look, we have... Um, it, with Danielle Henning is holding a Rhode Island Red. I know that much. Um, you have, I think, a Golden Comet, or is yeah. it the Buff? Uh, I'm not sure which one you've golden got. Golden Comet? It likes what you're doing, though. It's, and then um, I have the Silver Laced Wind Oat. There's different kinds of chicks. Yeah. Aren't oh, they, they so are cute? so cute. Look how adorable. They're just little. I could just take you home. They're just very comfy and cozy right now. And this is two days old. Gosh, yeah, wow. and in two weeks, they get really big. How <laughs> precious is this? And when you pick them up, um, oh, and then, by the way, they have these really good classes there to teach you how to care for the chicks mm -hmm. because it's very popular. A lot of people are buying chicks. You have to make sure that you got to check your town or city code. Yeah. Um, but when you buy them and you bring them home, they, they give they send you home with this little box, and that's so cute. Sound of spring in a box. It's their own she shed. See? <laughs> <laughs> it's a chick crate, and that's so cute. Aw, uh, this, this is spring right here. Hearing yeah. the birds chirping. Yes. I'm in Spring love. has sprung in our hands this morning. <laughs> Los pollitos dicen, oh, bio, left a bio, gift bio. here. <laughs> <laughs> and that's a wrap. Weekend buzz coming up next. What's going on in Rochester? Don't get away. Okay. <laughs> uh oh.